I'm going to put it out here, okay? I just got some mixed signals from Charles Richardson's show. He says on the air that he's never going to have me on the air, ever. Because Billy Painter is there. And arrogant douchebag Dirkwad mental retard midget who likes to smoke crack, he's there. And then Charles, and then, so I go to Charles, what the fuck is your problem? I agree to come on your show to see if we can, uh, whatever with that fucking piece of shit Billy cocksucker painter, which is never going to happen, by the way. We're going to be natural enemies to the day one of us die. That's for sure. Just like the onions. Okay? I got the same enemies for 50 years. It don't bother me to have a fucking enemy for 50 years. And it will not bother me to have an enemy for all eternity. Yeah. Right on. Because these people are a bunch of cowards. But let me get back you know, they do everything electronic. I wish they would come up to my fucking face. And they will see what the real fucking deal is. With that said, Charles is flaky. Charles is very flaky. He's off his rocker. He's saying, well, I'm not going to have you on my show in front of the uh, the douchebags there. And then all of a sudden, I text him. I go, what the fuck are you doing? What do you fucking say? You're not gonna have me on your show. Oh, I'm getting shit from every uh, from from people. I'm 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 I'm. They're saying they're gonna report me. Well, that's to be expected on terrestrial internet radio like Facecraft. You're out there on a uh, platform that's gonna fuck you, and you claim that you're uncensored. And you claim you're this and that? That you represent some kind of freedom? No, you don't. You're a slave. Just like the black people were in the 1800s. You're a slave. You're shackled. You got you got wrist restraints on you. And shackles and waist chains. Like they do in jail. You have no real freedom. No freedom at all. But I don't like this shit, bro. I don't like this two-faced, three-faced, ten-faced shit. Either you are with me or you're against me. I came on your show to give you motherfucker high ratings. Not the other way around. I already got my fucking high ratings. I don't need your show to get high ratings. I don't need Matt's show to get high ratings. I got high ratings. Okay? So I don't care about Matt Covington and his fucking bullshit station over there, those fucking jerk-off hillbilly cocksuckers. You know? I probably must have given them a heart attack, I, I swear, because they're so fucking stupid. They're, they're such simpletons, these people. They, they really have no fucking brains. Nothing. These people are... It's like they need new human brains. They really do. But you, you got to understand, you people are not from New York. You don't know the lifestyle of New York. You don't know the people of New York. You're just a bunch of fucking idiot douchebags. Right on? And I'm glad you don't like me. You see, I won. Today... I realized my victory. I'm doing victory laps around my house over here. That Billy Painter can't report me. They're not going to listen to him. No, they're not. They're not going to listen to that fucking asshole, douchebag, asswipe, hillbilly cocksucker. No way. So I'm going to do my show the way I want. Billy's not going to do nothing about it. Billy has been investigated for threatening me technically with a gun. And all is well here at the Crazy Joe Show Studios. All is well. And I will be on this Saturday at 8 
p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I will do a show, like a regular show. This will not be... Well, it's a demo, but it's not really a demo. It's just like if I was going to do a real show. Because I need to show my talents to a bunch of fucking ignorant white trash cocksuckers like these assholes here. And they're trying... You see, I realize now that they're trying to distract me. And they're trying to take away from my talent. Now, what Billy did to shut me down, that was fucked up. And I hope, Billy, that you fucking drop dead in your fucking sleep, motherfucker. Because I shouldn't say something like that. But that's how much I fucking hate your guts, okay? And you lay down one day and you never fucking wake up. Okay? For doing that shit to me. Because your intentions are evil. You might be a hillbilly from Idaho and a dumbass one at that. But evil is evil. And you are evil. And you should be put out of your misery by the comma. Because I don't like to say things like that. I don't want to wish people death. Because death is the end. But he threatened me again tonight. If he hears me say the N-word, he's going to report me. I gave him an opportunity to back down. To save face. And he didn't take it. So therefore, he should die. Not by my hand, by whatever. And maybe that's too extreme. Maybe he deserves, not death, but, you know, like him walking in a, in a, or driving and somebody crashes into him and he gets all fucked up. Maybe that should happen to him. I hope it doesn't happen to me because I never did anything wrong. I'm innocent. I just present things the way they are and people don't like it. See, pe- you know, I don't care about Charles' show. He doesn't have to have me. I don't give a flying fuck. Okay? Because I got my own thing going on here and that's all that matters. And I was going to do my own thing until Billy stuck his nose where it didn't fucking belong because he's nothing but a fucking punk, communist, vigilante, fascist, cocksucker, piece of shit who's part of this woke movement right now and he's trying to fuck with me and it's not going to happen. Okay? It's not going to happen because he ain't got nobody to report me to. My new company is not going to listen to him. He's not going to listen to you. He's not going to listen to none of you. My company is going to continue to carry the Crazy Joe show and there's not a fucking thing or a damn thing that none of you fucking monkey heads can do anything about. Because I am as tough as nails. I am taxi tested tough. And I don't back down from nobody. As a matter of fact, as I said hours ago, why don't you people leave? We don't want you here. If I knew who you people were, i fucking delete you right now. I throw your fucking ass out. I block your ass. That's why you won't say nothing to me because you know I will block your ass. So you're the cowards. But you got nothing to say because you're a bunch of pussies and punks. It is what it is. That's what you people are. And you don't impress me. Not one fucking bit. But I impress you. That's why you stay on my channel and suck my dick. And you're my fucking puppets out there. And I'm the puppet master. And I'll pull your string. Your strings. Because you know who the man is. Me. I'm your fucking master. I'm the fucking master of disaster. I'm the fucking man. And don't you fucking forget it either. And I think at this point. You're not going to forget it. And you're going to take me seriously. That I'm a bad dude. And I'm nobody to fuck with. Ask Billy. Ask Billy. 